What's up, YouTube? Today I am going to make. Turn that fan off. I'm going to be making a uh, a bean soup, but it's the super easiest way. And one of the ingredients you wouldn't expect to use is refried beans. Now, this is a good way to use your old beans. Just turn your old beans into soup. These are some old, um, these are just some leftover. I need to stop saying old. They're just leftover beans. And I'm gonna even show you how to make that with these. I wanna do some black beans. These come with uh, lime and jalapenos in it already. So I'm gonna show you how to make fried beans without really having to go through all of that. These beans right here already have the bacon fat in them and uh, the flavor of bacon is in, in those beans already. But this is what I wanted some black beans. So I have me some black beans. I'm just going to pop them in a food processor. The I'm gonna use the juice and everything because that'll get me started. And I'm gonna leave some of the beans whole just for texture. In this, I'm gonna use some diced tomatoes with green chilies. I'm gonna put that in there too. And then I'll leave some of them for texture. I'm almost getting full. I'm actually full up already. I'm gonna put some onion in here and some bell pepper. Y'all should eat a lot of this stuff. Onion and bell pepper. That's like that fights so much cancer and, and stuff. You need to eat a lot of this stuff. So there, I got that. I even had chopped up some of these chilies and I tend to use a lot of this juice in here too. This is nothing but white vinegar. That's what they put in there and whenever I use up the white vinegar in here, this gets really spicy, this vinegar. I just top it off with some more vinegar. So uh, that's how I do that and I keep myself not having to keep buying more and more and more and more. It's definitely a lot more soupier, but that's what we're gonna go and put this in water anyway. But that's that's a good way to get refried beans. Don't um, use the juice for the beans. Just, um, ooh, that's really good. So I'm just going to simply add my refried beans to my pot. These are the good beans right here. It's just like a, a, a one pot wonder, you know. We're gonna put everything in here. The rest of our um, onion and bell pepper in here too. And two of those chili peppers. Here I have some, some verde sauce this is creamy and this is the habanero i'm gonna use a little bit of both of them in this 
And I'm only doing this to taste. You can use whatever salsa you want to use. I'm gonna put the the beans in here also. These other beans. I'm going to put the rest of this can green chilies and tomato with the juices and everything in there. And I'll even put the rest of these whole beans in too with their gravy and everything. So this is what it's looking like, see that? I'm just gonna stir it up. That refried beans just instantly makes a, a thick soup. But you can always lighten this up with water. Okay, there's tons of flavor in here. If you don't want to lose any of that flavor, it's okay to put chicken stock, beef stock, vegetable stock, whatever stock, I don't know, not seafood though, not seafood stock. But. Okay, and so there we go. I'm actually probably going to add one can of water to this. So now you can see the uh, the consistency of it. This is soup. I know you might not be thinking this is not, that's not soup, but this is considered soup, okay? If you go into the store and you buy Milestone soup, it's really just tomato sauce with hard beans and vegetables in it. This is a delicious, quick, easy, fast soup that you can make. Okay. Back again. I want to show you the soup now. You can see it is nice and creamy. This is a delicious soup. Everything, the bell pepper and the onions have been cooked in. What I did was I just brought it up to a boil and then once it got to a boil, I um, put it on, I simmered it for, I, I think it was like 20 minutes, just simmering. It's gonna develop a lot of uh, foam on the top it's gonna develop a foam on the top, and all I did was skim all of that that foam off, which I think I'm not even sure if that's the gas coming out of the beans, but I got it off, and it just made the soup a lot better. So I'm just gonna try to um, get you a bowl of this. Okay, this is my bean soup. And what I like to also do to this is just pop it up in 
little bit of cheddar cheese right there. Maybe a few corn chips. And we'll go right in there. These corn, this is white corn chips with uh, uh, shea seeds in them. They're really good. So this is my black bean soup. Hope you like it in. Give it a taste. Mm. Wow, that's really good. Super quick, easy. Black beans, any kind of beans you want to use. You can even use white beans with this. Easy, super easy soup, you guys. Out of a can. No Nothing too technical, you know how I get down. So there you go. I haven't even really given it a fizzle name, just call it bean soup. <laughs> Thanks. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching.